my, oh my, my, oh my, a kiss, and so I did. Hi everyone, hello. How are we all doing today? Hope we're having a fantastic week so far and a fantastic Wednesday. How's everyone doing? So today we're gonna be in our hardcore world and we're gonna be working on um, the next project. So you guys are gonna see some spoilers, just so you guys know. But there's a... Um, there's a lot that we have to do in this world, so that's why we're not streaming modded this week, but we will probably stream modded next week, depending on how much we get done today. But we're gonna jump right in. Let me load up my game. Oh no, chocolate, I hope that you feel better soon. Bye, Leon. have a good one. Yo, Tanichi, hello, welcome in. Wayward Bar, just had my breakfast, let's go. What'd you have? Aphrodite, hello. Teresa, hello. Florida, hello. Minimal, Jinx, Rose, hello, Ryder, Kendall, some artist. How you doing? Ivy, welcome in. How's it going? How's it going? Jahel, hello, hello. Coffee Pixel, nice to see you. Ed Sheeran, oh my god, you're famous. Welcome in. Rilam, hello, hello. Farah, hello. Sphia. Let's go. I see you. Rebecca. Hi, darling. I feel like I know who you are, Rebecca. Demon is live. Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Lee Angel, hello. How is everyone? Yeah, no worries, Lee Angel. All good, all good. Rainbow, welcome in. How you doing? Sienna, hello. How are ya? You just had some breakfast too. What did you have? Banana and soft boiled eggs with some chili crisp. Ooh, that sounds really good. Okay um here we go chat let's um let's get into the game let me switch over hopefully this is working yeah okay rebecca i thought so i thought so it should be working hi jazzy welcome welcome thank you so much florche juno says this is the first time i'm able to watch you stream and i'm so excited let's go i'm excited too so chat we have a little bit of a problem in this world, and um, as you guys might have seen, um, we used to have a really, really messy storage. Um, but as you can tell, oops, sorry, one sec. As you can tell from the name of this video, we are building an auto sorting storage system. So let me let me get up here and I'll show you guys around really quickly if you haven't been here before or if it's been a while all 
All right, where? So, okay. <laughs> all the chest mess and the shulkers, almost all gone. So I hope that you guys are proud of me. You know, I, I'm working on it. I promise. I <laughs> We're working hard. There's no messy shulkers right here either. No messy shulkers upstairs. It's all taken care of. Been so busy with work? No worries, Tanichi. Hope that you've been well, though. Aw, oh, Rachel, thank you so much. That's so kind. How do auto storage systems even work? I will, I will show you once we go downstairs. So I have been working now. We're gonna we're gonna look at my face for this. I have been working on this, okay? Non I worked nine hours today on this. And I also worked Saturday, and I also worked Friday, and I also worked Thursday last week, and Monday, and I worked a little bit on Sunday as well. So um this is our world. It's getting pretty big, you know. There's our starter house, we have our bee farm, we have our well, also our greenhouse. Our smelter, our sugarcane farm, our wool farm, our cactus farm, our iron farm. And then over there, we have a tree farm underneath that building. But we were acquiring a lot of things, chat. A lot of things. And if you guys remember, we were basically building up little areas in this world that were, like, very decorative. So let's go over here. Like, we built this little pond together. And we built this area right here. Like, this little field of roses. Do you guys remember that? Yo, Serena, hello, hello. We built this like little park. Oh my gosh, do you guys remember the park that we built with like the, the iron golem park? Well, we also built this pond last time, you know, well, also the pandas, but we don't talk about the pandas, okay? Yeah, hello, Ryder. We have a frog light farm in this world as well, yeah. But, um, we built this pond last time, and I told you, I told y'all, what is going on with that? Like, have you guys noticed that in my videos before? That chunk is so weird. <laughs> it's only that one, like, little spot, and then if I fly towards it, it'll fix itself. But it's just so weird. I don't know why. But I have been digging. I have been digging because this is going to be the entryway, the entry cave into our storage system. So chat, are you guys ready? Are you guys ready to see it? Look at that. I have been doing a lot of work, chat. This was all stone. I I mined all this. Look at look at this. This is all hooked up to the system already. So if we have like let's say some dark oak logs. As you see here, we have four stacks. We can come around here to the barrel, add them in there. And look at that! It's just sorting itself! Look at that! We did it! <laughs> now, obviously, it still needs some decorating, and I'm not done digging. So that's what we're going to be doing today. We're going to be digging, because I just did this, like, right before stream today. I just dug this out. Um, and as you can see, I was adding in the blocks into the floor for like where things are going to be sorted to. Um, and yeah, there's, we have a lot of digging to do. We have this, this one right here, this, how long this is, is also going to be in that direction. The same amount of like as long. <gasps> Brooksy. Oh my gosh. Hi, love. You're so cute. Bro, Winchester says, hi, I'm new here. I'm from Brazil. I discovered your channel a couple weeks ago. Oh my gosh. Hi, welcome in. Hope you're doing well. 
yeah so as you guys can see we have the blocks that are being sorted underneath displayed like here um and then we have also some manual sorting i don't want like my flowers and stuff to be auto sorted i want to do that myself so these ones i'm sorting myself but this is how the display looks so basically the barrel is on top of the item it's displaying or that it's storing so like tulips are right here and oxide daisies are here then you have you know the tall flowers and all sorts of like little sprouts and grass and drip leaf and lily pads and stuff all the way to the end of the the line rosé bear i'm doing good i hope you're also doing good How do hoppers work? I want to make a storage like that, but I don't understand. Okay, so the the one video that I watched, I'm gonna link in the description of this video when it comes out. Um, but it was from Pixel Riffs Coffee. Just can you add me in the Discord and just remind me to send you the link for that? Cause I I've gotta find which one it was. Um, but basically how this works is that you know you set up your chest and then you set your hoppers into your chest and then you make a like comparator like reader for a hopper i don't really 100 percent understand how it works but basically like once the number of items goes up in here there's a redstone torch that's like locking the hopper the comparator will send a signal to like turn off the torch so that the item can go in basically that's basically how it works But I, I don't really know much beyond that. I just know how to make it pretty. That's all I know how to do. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to dig and we're going to make it pretty. Yo, Aurelia, welcome in. How you doing? Thank you so much, Jody, as well. I'm doing good, though, Rosé Bear. I hope you're also doing good. I hope everything's been well. Next video, can you make a fa fairy-themed village? So this, this storage system is going to be the next video. Um, but I don't know what's coming after that. I do believe I'm going to be making um, the custom village over here. Like this custom village. But I don't think it's going to be necessarily like fairy themed. But we could do a fairy themed village in the future. That went up and over my head. Yeah, I had, I had to watch some videos to like learn how to do it. But I don't 100% understand it. I just kind of sort of know how it works. Also, I saw Shade in here. Hi, Shade. Been a while. Hope you're doing well. <laughs> Yo, Alfie, hello, hello. So I hope you guys don't mind. It's probably going to be pretty boring today because we're basically just going to be mining, but at least we'll be able to chat a lot. I guess that's the good part, right? And before we start in this room, um, I have to mine out the top. I didn't realize I had to mine out the top. So we've got to mine all the way to this block here. Yeah, so. We're just going to get started. Yeah, mining is satisfying, but I just don't, I don't want anyone to be bored or anything. So if you guys have other stuff to do, if you guys want to just have this on in the background or whatever, that's totally fine. No, no pressure to stick around and hang out. I just wanted to, I just wanted to stream some progress on this because I know a lot of people were like, when is another hardcore video coming out? And I just want you guys to know, I started this project on day 717 in game. It, it is day 796. I'm work, I promise. This is almost a hundred Minecraft days. <laughs> I, I am, I promise I'm working on it. Hi, Seb. Welcome in. Hope you're doing well today, love. I'm doing good, Jazzy. I am doing good. I just had dinner. Now I feel very energized and I'm ready to continue on the grind. How's it going, Seb? Hope you're having a wonderful day. What texture packs do you have on? Um, They're all linked in the description, love. If you, um, if you head to the description, you'll find all the packs that I'm currently using. Oh, 
where do I have to come down with this? Here, okay. Oh gosh. Oh, also we have a villager that I brought down here. He he trades redstone, so I've been trading with him on and off. I'm eating jelly beans. Ooh, that sounds good. What flavors? Do you guys ever get those jelly beans that have like all the different flavors in one bag? And then there's always like, whenever I reach into those, I always get like the nasty jelly beans. Like why, why am I getting the worst jelly beans? What's your favorite animal? Um, dogs for sure. Dogs are top tier. No offense to cat lovers. I like cats. I'm just allergic to them. Oh, you you forget it's nighttime for me? Yeah, it is currently 7.16 p.m. for me. Well, I guess we'll have to mine this out eventually, so we'll just leave that. But I just want to get the area like that is under where we, or over where we already mined. I want to get that done. That block right there is going to be a frog light right there. And then this block has to go, that block has to go, but this one can stay. The white jelly beans are gross. Does anyone else like the popcorn jelly bean? Are there any other popcorn jelly bean fans? I feel like I'm the only one. Yeah, I'm, um, I'm really allergic to long haired cats. Red, welcome in. How you doing, love? Hope you're doing well. Oh, hello, Ryder. You are not funny. <laughs> my favorite is Capybara. Oh my gosh, I just painted a Capybara eating a piece of pizza over on Twitch. Well, not too long ago, I guess. Yeah, that's right. Okay. That's right. Those are tasty, but I prefer the watermelon ones. I mean, the fruit ones are always top tier, right? Eating some lunch? Oh my gosh, what are you having? I just had leftover like um, spicy beef and rice. It was so, so good. Oh, bruh. I gotta stop mining those. I don't need to mine that much. All right, let me go get frog lights. That way we can remember where the line is. Hold on, chat, let me cook. I ate a potato and cheese for lunch. Oh, that sounds good too. My husband likes the cotton candy. The cotton candy ones are fire. To be fair. To be 100% fair. Yo, Cuticor. Hello, hello. Going good. I hope you're also going good. Where's all my sticks? I think I just saw them, right? Yeah, I did. Also, eventually I will get rid of all the torch spam. I just want you guys to know that. I hate it too. It is not pretty. It is not cute. I dislike it very much. I'm eating pot roast and, uh, with potatoes and broccoli I made the other day. Oh my gosh, yes. Leftovers hit different, especially leftovers for lunch. Someone threw a potato at me once. Oh my gosh, <laughs> that's amazing. And now you guys are best friends. I feel like that's what happened with me and Sev. Only instead of a potato, it was insults. You know? Well, I guess it would be insulting to have a potato thrown at you.
Yeah, I'm really scared of stuff spawning in here. I'm not gonna lie. That's how you won me over? Yeah, and now I just say stuff like, damn, you had a baby and then you changed. No, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding, like, oh. you only have time for your baby now. God, imagine imagine taking your kid taking priority over your friends. Weird. Very weird. Very weird behavior. Okay. Oh my gosh, you guys, I did not think I was going to survive that day with me and Sev talking about that silly glare. I was so ready. I was like, Sev, I'm going to come to your house and I'm going to kick your ass. Like... No, but Brooksy actually had the cutest baby ever though. Like the actual cutest baby ever. I know a lot of people say their baby is the cutest baby ever. No, Brooksy's baby. Cutest baby ever. Are you following a tutorial? No, I'm just um I'm just building my own way. I did learn about like how to make the system from a tutorial, but the the actual build itself is just my own little brain doing stuff. Children are a zero out of ten from me. <laughs> okay, well, I think your baby's cool. Put put your baby on Minecraft right now. Damn, not Brooksy ro roasting her own baby. I get it though. You gotta teach him young, you know. Oh my god, that is so satisfying. Just picking up all this, all the blocks. Minecraft baby mod? Is there a Minecraft baby mod? Making your own thing in Minecraft is pretty fun. Um, I, I won't lie. A lot of the storage is sort of like partially inspired by Infinite Drift and partially inspired by Mr. Beardstone. Like the height is definitely inspired by Infinite Drift. Um, and just like I learned a lot from watching Mr. Beardstone. So I definitely want to give him some credit as well because he taught me a lot that I didn't know. Um, but the actual like I, I designed this myself in a in a creative world and then kind of like brought over some ideas. It's not exactly how my creative one was. Um, but it, it's close. I, I just figured out while I was doing it, um, for real that I liked a different way a little bit better. We do this thing called Rose Weekend in our house where nothing's off limit and it makes our relationship so much stronger. Oh my gosh. Um, I do that too with my partner, but I don't know if he's in on it. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know if he realizes that's what's happening. Also, is the, the Minecraft volume too loud? I turned it up a little bit, but let me know if it's too loud for you guys if you want it to be turned back down. Shannon, hi love, how are you doing? Oh, 
Also, let me know what you guys think of seeing me work on a project in real time. Like, obviously, when the video comes out, you guys are going to be like, oh my god, I was there when she was building that. Um, if you guys have been here for this for this stream, make sure you comment that on the video. That way we know who the real ones are. No, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Uh, hello, Ryder. Please keep the chat in English, love. It's perfect on speakers, but I don't know if it's too loud for headphones. I can turn it down just a little tiny bit. There we go. <gasps> you just watched the last episode yesterday, Mackie? Oh my gosh. Thank you for watching. I know it's been a long time since I've made an episode. Um, Honestly, I was really nervous to make this. I was really, really nervous to make the system, so... I'm actually getting really excited now that it's like actually underway, but I've wanted to build this for a very long time. I've been planning this, like how to build this for like two months. I love your lives. Thank you. Okay. Um, we need to mark out how many spaces I need 80 spaces. So that counts five on both sides. So we have to make like eight like pods is what i'm calling them like but between the two pillars we have to make eight of those um i just need some stairs so we can start marking them out do i not have any more stairs did i use them all okay i used them all Pom Pom Peko, I agree with that. Sometimes it's really nice just to watch somebody else, you know, do like, do the work and just like enjoy the vibes, you know? Oh, also chat. Oh my God. Yesterday I farmed like four shulker boxes worth of spruce. Look, at this is all I have left. The last week or two, I'd watch an episode before bed. I love your content. Thank you so much, Maggie Roll. That is so kind. How have you been, Shannon? Hope you're doing well. How many hours did it take you to build this? This this storage system I've been working on for um, 80 Minecraft days. So each each in-game day is 20 minutes and I've slept five times. So however many minutes that is. The brick looking block, this one right here? Sorry, uh, Buini. I didn't see your comment at first, but this one right here, this is red nether brick and Mizuno's. All right. Um. Oh, not this way, other way. So basically, um, just also to explain, um, this, this law or this like hallway is basically like logs and nature blocks. This one is like stones and nether and end and like deep dark and ice. Um, this one is going to be like all the colored blocks, like wool, terracotta, concrete, um, all that stuff. And then this one is going to be everything else. So I don't know how, how long this one's going to have to be yet. Um, that's why we're going to work on this one. Cause we definitely know how long this one's going to be. Okay. So there's 10, 20, 30, 40. Okay, so basically we need to dig this out to be at the a double what it is right now. Oh, it's gonna be a long day. How do you get such good seeds? I seed search a lot before I start playing. A lot. My Uber Eats comes in 20 minutes. Oh my gosh, what did you order? 
All right, so what? how many? That was 40. So this is one. I need to do 24 spaces. So let's count this as one. Actually, I'll need to do 26 because of the redstone. 20, 27 to be safe. So one, two, hold on. Let me, let me count three, four, Five, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, we gotta dig till here. Oh my god, that's a lot. That's a that's a lot, chat. That's a lot. I got some Jersey Mike's. Oh my gosh. What's your favorite kind of sandwich? Do you like Ariana Grande? I do. How do you seed search? Um, so I watch YouTube videos a lot, honestly, for like good seeds. Uh, a great channel for that is like Minecraft and chill. Or I go to like a website like um, Chunk Base and I just like, um, I just like like randomize the seed over and over again till I find one that looks interesting and then I go there in world and like see if I like it out basically. Yo, Tysia, welcome in. How's it going? All right, how far? Oh my gosh, this is quite far and there's like all sorts of mobs that are able to get to us. Hold on. Not good chat. Not good. So from up here, this is technically number two. So three, four, five, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, sixteen. Twenty this is twenty one. Twenty two. Twenty three. Twenty four. Twenty five. Oh God. 26, 27, maybe? I don't know, but we're gonna cover it up because I'm scared. I don't know what's out there. Jinx, I hope that it goes well. It's been once once you on like once you have like the basic redstone down, then then it's like much much easier to go ahead with the whole project. Um, for me, it was just like kind of figuring it out. I was kind of in my head about it, if that makes sense. Like I did not think that I could do this. Where do you get the inspiration for your builds? Love your storage room design. I just um I just played around with this in creative, although I did take a little bit of inspiration from Infinite Drift Space. Um and her storage. Her storage is amazing. Uh definitely recommend if you guys haven't seen it. Um if you guys haven't seen her stream survival series, it's very, very chill. A very, very pretty world. Um, but otherwise I just kind of started making a storage design that I felt like would make sense. Um, once I had the chests in place, then I started building around it, basically. Bye, hello, Ryder. Have a good one. Redstone's my weakness. I hate it so much. I'm getting better, though. Yeah, I mean, I don't really know what it all does. I'm just kind of trying to do it, you know? We're just, we're just vibing, basically. 
anyone else scared when I go into these like little holes? Oh man. Oh bruh. You know, they don't they don't really pay me enough, honestly, to do this, so <laughs> we're just we're just gonna pretend that that doesn't exist. That's not our problem, honestly. What's the name again? For what? Sorry. What's your favorite type of stone? Oh, that's a good question. I think stone brick. Just remembered, I've been watching Frog for two years. Oh my God, that's dedication. Let me go. I love your relaxing long plays. Thank you. I really enjoy making them as well. Definitely going to be making more um in the coming t in the coming time i've been like really trying to get better at like getting faster at making videos honestly one day i'll get there yo oh my gosh chibi hello yeah we are we are digging we have just been non-stop mining stone that's basically my my name now mining stone crafting Did we? Oh my god, we're on the we're on the perfect number. Holy, let's go. We girl boss that. We we knew exactly how much we needed to go. You were talking about where you were looking for inspiration. Um for the storage room, I took inspiration from Infinite Drift. Um who's another YouTuber here, you know, on YouTube. Um but otherwise, um, otherwise it's just like whatever I was, whatever I was cooking up, you know, and creative. I actually think we do need all of this here. And I really don't want to go in there, so we're not going to. We're just going to pretend that doesn't exist. Oh, I don't have the beacon back here. What? I do here though. Yo, Alexandra, hello. Welcome in. How you doing? Chat, can someone grab the link to Drift's channel and just post it in the chat? Um, at least for the storage system, the the channel that I was super inspired by was Infinite Drift. Ask what mod you use to look around in the world. It's um, it's called the it's a free cam mod. Um, it's I think it's just free cam for fabric. Um, something like that. Oh, thank you, Glygoth. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate that. Very, very much so. If you guys aren't already subscribed to Drift as well, make sure you do. If you like my content, you will love Drift's content. Ari the Dragon, I'm doing good. We're just... Well, we're mining. Um, we're currently kind of making a like little edge perimeter thingy around all the stuff we have to mine. And then we're just going to like mine the middle. But 
my pickaxes are getting pretty low and this is my second pickaxe i went and got a this is my second pickaxe chat i have the fortune one but i have two silk touch ones i went and farmed a silk touch pickaxe for this video can you believe that i went and got a netherite pickaxe just for this video I told you guys, I told you guys, I am like committed to the grind right now. I am feeling so inspired. I'm feeling a little bit silly. We might have to go to the Enderman farm though and, and repair our stuff. I'm not gonna lie, we might have to. torched up there okay i'm gonna just cover this because we don't have to worry about anything up there that's like higher than where we're mining out to what happened what do you mean what happened that groundhog said spring's coming i'm a new woman <laughs> that's actually hilarious hello <laughs> yo hubris hubris games welcome and how you doing hope you're doing well also are you guys liking this playlist i feel like it's really chill it's very nice to mine too Gonna be playing some Animal Crossing. Oh my gosh, enjoy, enjoy. Hope the Animal Crossing goes well. Hope you pay off all your debts to Tom Nook if you still have them. Or should I say Tom Crook? scared what's, up, what's going on up there you know what that's not our business not our business 2024 chat that's that's where we're at right now not not our business we have no no need for to know that yo shanna hello hello hope you've been well welcome in Also, what's new with everyone? Tell me, chat. What's 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 the gossip? What have you been up to? What's been going on? Any anyone have any fun news to share? Because I'm so interested. All I do is silly silly pickaxe grind. Okay, I need I need something juicy. Well, it doesn't have to be juicy, but just something other than mining stone. Also, sorry, that was pretty bright. I'm, I apologize. I paid everything off, full upgrades and such. Just finished my island. I'm setting everything up for my dream address. Oh my gosh, let's go. Love that. I had my first driving lesson today. Heck yeah, let's freaking go. My cat is pregnant. Oh my gosh, are you excited? Having some kittens in the house. I got cottage cheese. I love cottage cheese, low key. I got a drawing pad, so I've been doing digital paintings. Yeah, that is awesome. I love that. Do you feel like it's um like harder to use or are you like adjusting to it really well? Oh, let's go, Jazzy. That's awesome. Congratulations. Hope the stream goes well if you go through with it. Oh man. I I thought that, that that bat almost got yeeted out of existence, chat. Like no joke. Not trolling. I would have fought that bat for what for what they did. 
I remember the cottage cheese from Twitch. Oh my gosh, yes, I love cottage cheese. Kind of like it's a low key love of mine, you know? You can't mention that you like cottage cheese in the wrong company, is all I'm saying. Yo, Isabel, welcome in. I'm doing good. Hopefully, you're also doing good. My dad's birthday is today. Happy birthday to him. Hope he had a great birthday. Did you guys do anything to celebrate? I just baked a yummy blueberry lemon pound cake. Okay, Danny, I'm coming over. I know you didn't invite me, but I gotta, I gotta try a piece. I love cottage cheese. My grandma used to give me cottage cheese when I was young, so that's probably why I don't mind it, but it's a texture food for sure. If textures bother you that are kind of like a little bit funky, it might not be something that you'll enjoy. Look at all this gravel. We'll never need any more gravel ever again. We have so much. We can make so much like horse dirt and what else do people make with gravel? Flint. I don't really think we need flint though. Um, What's the other thing? Concrete powder. That's it. We put balloons in the kitchen and jump scared him. Oh my gosh. That sounds amazing though. Happy birthday to your dad. I hope you guys have, or I hope he had a wonderful day. Do you like cats? I like cats, but cats don't really like me. I'm, um, I'm very allergic to cats. A little, uh, a little slice of cake and a little cup of Earl Grey tea. Oh my gosh, I'm so ready. Oh my gosh chat warn me if my pickaxe starts to get lower like if it gets into the red just put it like everyone yell at me in caps in chat because i am not really paying attention and i what if i just break this pickaxe you know i have two cats as well mackie um but my my partner had them before i moved in with him and obviously i would never make him get rid of his you know his cats well like, I, I love the cats so much. They are so sweet and cuddly, but they just uh, irritate my eyes and make me itch and stuff, you know? It's like, I can live with the allergy. It just sucks. enjoy this kind of stream though it like gives us a chance to be really chatty you know because i mean like we're mostly safe i know it's hardcore like anything could happen please don't let this be like a moments before disaster thing like because if i if i die after i mind all this out i'm gonna be very upset But I'm really enjoying just vibing here with you guys. I have been streaming this in my Discord as well because I couldn't handle being alone with my thoughts and mining stone. You know what I mean? Like, I was thinking about, like, what if I try... I was trying to invent a new type of food chat. Like, I, that's what I was thinking about. And I was like, you know what? I can't do this anymore. The playlist is really good. Thank you. Thank you. This is an epidemic playlist. It's called Soft Beats. It's pretty chill. The pick is in red. Oh. Chat, we still have time. 344 durability. We're fine. We're fine. We're... Let me know when it gets down to like a hundred chat. Come on now. We're, we're still at 318. We're fine. 
<laughs> oh my gosh, thank you guys for telling me that. Thank you for telling me. Well, let me let me put some torches. I'll go get I'll go get the fortune pickaxe and we can swap it out. I did tell you guys to warn me. <laughs> I was just trolling you guys. See, this one I let to get 163 and I was like getting a little bit uncomfortable. I was like, you know what? That's probably too I I'm probably pushing this a little bit too far, you know? Y'all repairing when it's on 50%? Absolutely. Not even joking. 75%. If I can see the slightest bit of like the fact that the pickaxe is mine something, I'm over there at that Enderman farm. Yeah, we'll we'll go repair it once um once this one's also close to being uh you know unalived. My seven-year-old granddaughter found you through Infinite Drift's Castaway series, and she'll be so sad that I saw this while she's at school. She absolutely obsessed with your channel. Oh my gosh! Hi, welcome in. Oh my gosh, that is so sweet. Thank you so much. I hope she has a great day at school, and school's way more important than a stream. What's your favorite color? My favorite color is actually brown. I think brown is just such a, a gorgeous color, like especially if it has like red and orange kind of like undertones, like a burnt sienna type of color. The pickaxe is very important. Yeah, very, very important. I promise we, we will save the pickaxe. Also, when you're mining these like little ore nodes, it's so silly and annoying. You know what I mean? Like it's, those don't insta mine. They're just, they just take forever. Can you give me a challenge to do on Minecraft? Um, defeat the ender dragon. When do you plan on doing the 100K video? So, okay, big news about the 100K video. I had to wait for my play button to get here because obviously we hit 100K. Um, but it has, it has arrived. I just want you guys to know I have gotten it. Um, after this video, I'm going to be filming, um, building some custom trees in this world and I'll be answering the questions in that video. So it'll be after this video comes out that I'll start filming. If you'd add a block to Minecraft, what would it be? Terracotta stairs and slabs. And also... If I could add one thing to Minecraft, it would be stairs and slabs and walls of every block and trapdoors. That's a lot of things, but continuity is what I would add to Minecraft. There we go. No, thank you guys. You guys are the ones who made even getting to 100k possible. So thank you guys so much for, for being here, for subscribing for watching the, the content it really really means the world thank you imagine we could have strawberries in minecraft like imagine you could make like a, a little sandwich with jam like strawberry jam on a sandwich in minecraft I'm just saying they should hire me. I know what the people want. I know what the girlies want, okay? Mojang, if you're listening, I'm ready to give you all the best ideas that have ever been given. My little sister started experiencing people hating her. Now she has beef with one or two group tables at the school cafeteria. Oh no. Oh! Um. Excuse me. Y'all aren't allowed to be here. <laughs> I'm sorry, but like. I've watched you for a whole years and I didn't realize I wasn't subscribed until last month. Oh my gosh. Did you finally hit the subscribe button? 
your sandwiches are here. Oh my gosh, enjoy, lovely. Oh, I hope they're the best sandwiches ever. Wait, those don't go in there. These do though. Drop all of this stuff. I guess we could combine these into that inventory and I don't think I'll need that stuff for a little bit. Look at how much we've already gotten done though. It's only been an hour in this stream. We already have over half of this already done. I found your channel a year ago. Also, I love strawberry jam. Oh my gosh, yes. I'm so upset that cherry trees don't drop cherries like apples. Such a missed opportunity. Do um do cherry trees in real life? Like sakura trees have cherries? If the, if they were like based off of like you know, um like cherry blossom trees, I understand if they don't drop cherries, but I don't know if those drop cherries in real life. But yeah, I think that fruit trees in Minecraft would be huge. I, I'm definitely down for like more, but I just want like a farmer's delight update. You know what I mean? Like I want to be able to cook recipes and like have more saturation from those recipes. Do you have any mods in the hardcore world? No, just some, just some texture packs. I have a couple of data packs, but no, no mods. It's, it's vanilla. You could pretty much do the same exact world that I have. Why don't we have an apple pie option? That's a good question. You know what? Night Winnie right there asking the important questions. If there was an apple pie option in Minecraft, how many people would, would bake it? Some do. I had a cherry tree in the front yard of my old house. I had a pink blossoms in spring and cherries in the summer. Oh my gosh. Oh, awesome. Well then, yeah, it should. It should have cherries. What should I build in Minecraft? Build a windmill. I really want to build a windmill in this world. We don't have one yet. And I think that we need one so badly. I want to be able to date an Enderman. Me too. Also a piglin brew. I just feel like I could fix him. And a wither skeleton, you could slide them my number, you know what I mean? Also, while we're at it, why can't we date the ender dragon? I think that we need more placeable food in general though. Like playing with the Farmer's Delight mod and other mods that are similar that have placeable food. Like why do we only have cake that we can place? I want to be able to place like a whole roasted chicken. Are you a Krobus girly? I am. I'm actually, ro well, I'm like platonically trying to become entangled with Probus in my Stardew Valley Twitch save. I'm just saying I need I need the Ender Dragon to be voiced by Jennifer Coolidge in the Minecraft movie. I'm just putting it out there. Yeah, Mizuno CIT yeah, has placeable food, but I want everyone to have the option to have placeable food, not just people who use CIT. We play on my PS4. Does anyone know if it's playable on laptop? Um, You can, but you might run into some performance issues, Athena. It depends on like what kind of um, hardware is in the laptop. Ender Dragon should be Sean Connery like Dragonheart. The Ender Dragon's a woman though. Her name is Jean. I just can't imagine Sean Connery's voice with that. Just 
Oh, bruh. Look at look at how much we have done. Look at us. We are absolutely girl bossing this right now. Just go away, please. Do a face reveal, bro. Um, I'm good. Thanks, though. I love how everyone names the Ender Dragon something. Her name is Jane. It, her name is... That's her real name. That was the name given to her. Do you like warrior cats? I don't know if I've ever seen warrior cats. Is that a movie or a comic or something? There's a lot of dudes right there. You know what? I'm just gonna put this under not my business 2024. That's that's the name of the game, chat. Not my business. We are minding our business 2024. Isn't it Bertha? Who are you talking about, Bestie? Who the who the who? Are, what are you, what are you talking about? <gasps> Lawrence, hello, love. Did Mojang actually name her Jean? Yeah, her name is Jean. There's no confirmed movie yet? This Yes, there is. It, it has an IMDb thing. Jack Black is in it. So is um, uh, Jason Momoa. And so is Jennifer Coolidge. The, the Mojang, or the, the Minecraft movie is confirmed, chat. What's your favorite block and least favorite block in vanilla Minecraft and in Mizuno's? Least favorite block in both is probably Netherrack, just because I find it really hard to use, especially in Mizuno's. Favorite block in vanilla is Spruce Trapdoor. Favorite, favorite block in Mizuno's is uh brown mushroom block or prismarine oh talking about warrior cats oh okay my bad my bad chat chat let's keep it on topic okay we're talking about minecraft I can't keep up with y'all. Y'all are having your own conversations. How long did it take for you to do all of this? Um, we're at 81 Minecraft days. I hate tough block. I like tough in vanilla. Tough in Mizuno's is a little bit, well, <laughs> tough. <laughs> Never mind. Anyways, moving on. What's your favorite Minecraft biome? Good question. Flower Forest and um, the old the old taiga, like the mega taiga. I think it used to be called. Does anyone remember the Minecraft Hunger Games? That was like, that that was Fortnite before it was Fortnite. The Minecraft Hunger Games were real. Good 
guys, I'm never gonna need stone ever again. Ever, ever, ever again. And look, if we look in my storage, right? Let's look at my storage. I have so much stone. Your streams are really cozy, thank you. I can't believe we got that done so fast. Oh my gosh. All right, let's grab our dark oak. I hope you guys don't mind that there's like spoilers today. How do you guys feel about spoilers in general though? Let me know. Like, especially about videos, like working on projects like this, do you guys like seeing the progress or would you prefer it like stays a surprise until the video comes out? There's no, there's no wrong answer by the way. Like obviously like everyone has their own preferences, but just let me know how you guys feel about streams like this. Cause I've always been kind of like afraid to do spoilers. I, I thought people didn't really like them that much. I don't really mind. I'm fine with spoilers. I personally don't mind it. This one is great. Okay, okay. I love a little tease. Okay, okay, bestie. I see you pop off. Like, hello? I love spoilers because they're almost like cliffhangers because you don't know the final result, but you're excited to find out. That is a good way to put it. I'm glad that you guys feel that way. Show the progress because we get to see the pro thought process and the funny moments. That's true. I um I talked through a lot of the thought process as well because I built I built a lot of this part of the system like first in first person like being like I'm doing this you know um this is the reason or like walking through my thought process. I did a lot of that in the video, and what I have edited in the video is already chat. It's already 16 minutes long, so this video is probably gonna be like. 30, 35 minutes. So it'll be, it'll be a pretty decently long one chat. What would you do if you turned around and there were a thousand witches behind you? Like Minecraft witches? I would run. <laughs> Yo, Frog, are you trying to get numbers? Only from only from Wither Skeletons, you know? Aw, oh, thank you so much, Nicole. I appreciate that. That is so sweet. Let's um, remove that one. Because sometimes I'm looking for something safe that I already know I'll like, but sometimes I look for surprises, so no spoilers that time. That's fair, Minnie. That's fair. I was talking about this with some YouTuber friends of mine and a lot of them also try not to show spoilers um, for episodes. So this was sort of like a test for all of us to see if we would actually like, if we would like it, if our audience would like it. So, you know, there's, there's no wrong answer if you guys don't like it or if you, you know, if you're like, eh, you know, it was okay. That, that's also fine, you know? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nice. We have just enough room. Yo, 
welcome back, welcome back. You you said it was the best sandwich ever. I don't I don't remember if you answered earlier, but what did you end up getting on your sandwich? Have you ever heard of Sam Gladiator? I don't think I have ever heard of them. Half the time I don't know what the build will be until I'm told. Gotcha, got you. You mean from the episode? We might have to go also get some dark oak logs because I think we're going to run out, chat. We see it in the thumbnail anyways. It's two different experiences, like a long play and edited content. So true. So true. This is just sort of like a lot of like a hardcore long play, right? Speaking of, I actually would really like to do a, a hardcore long play if you guys would be interested in seeing that. So let me know. Like, obviously, you know... Let me know your thoughts, chat. Also, hi, Firecrackle. Welcome in. Hope you're doing well, lovely. Hope 2024 has been kind to you so far. I got a bacon, chicken, and ranch cheesesteak. Oh my gosh, that sounds really good. Like, hello? I'm coming over. I would so love that. I think I would really enjoy that as well. Um, Cause I think it would be a fun experience to like build something in this world. Like since we're already established here, you know what I mean? Obviously we still have the modded long plays and um, we will still have, you know, I'll every once in a while, if I just feel like building something in a fresh world, like we can always do those as well. Sometimes I like doing it from, you know, a fresh world. It's just like a little bit of an extra challenge. I would be interested. I feel like it would be awesome to see a whole bunch of builds in uh, one world. So, um, so just for you guys to know in the future, this village is going to be getting a transformation so i'm not going to keep the village on the mountain i started terraforming down here so we would have room for the village so basically like the rosewood is going to have like this like good basically trade relationship with the villagers that live in this area and i'm going to be building them their own custom village and i'm really really excited about it really really excited about it i can't wait um but I also agree. I really, really want to see like a lot of builds in one world. This is this is my favorite world that I've ever made. I definitely and like we're gonna we're gonna be in this world. This will be like you know always on the channel until well until we until we die. Let's hope that we don't die though. Okay. What map is this? This is a uh, Zero's world map mod for Fabric. I um I use a map mod and I know some people probably don't like map mods. Um you don't have to play with one if you don't like one, but I have I have a really hard time with coordinates. One, two, and then three. So this one right here will be stairs. The 118 world, um, the 118 world was fun. It was my first time ever making, um, anything on YouTube. But I, I definitely like this world better than the 118 world, but at this point. Is that correct? One, two, and three. Yeah, okay, that's correct on both sides. Cool. We're gonna have a ham sandwich with apple, like on the same sandwich. I've never heard of that before, but I, I don't think it would be bad. We still haven't popped a totem in this world. So I feel pretty good. We have been, we have survived in this world 
799 days. Guys, we're almost at 800 days. I can't believe that. In the last episode, okay, think about this. In the last episode, we we hit 700 days. This is my longest ever hardcore world that I've ever had. Ellen, um, that's kind of a weird question. Sliced apple on a ham sandwich. I can I can understand how that would be good. I feel like the 118 world ended really quickly. Yeah, I um so I wanted to start oh, the reason that that world ended was because I wanted to just, I wanted to play hardcore um for 119 when it came out so i ended the world about a month before the 119 update came out um i i didn't want to end it that way but like obviously you know sometimes the series has to come to an end um but don't worry there's there's a lot in this world that takes inspiration from that world as well Sorry, chat. I had nine DMs, so I was hoping that I wasn't missing a message from my partner, but we're good. I want to grab an apple. Oh my gosh, yes. An apple would be amazing right now. Although I just did have dinner. Also, I am I cannot be the only one that struggles to place stairs upside down, right? Like, I feel like that always takes me so long. Thank you, Mystical. Amy, welcome in. How you doing? I'm actually writing a book series, so I was wondering if you wanted your own character. I mean, if you want to include me, that would be cool. Or, or like a character based off me, that would be cool. But no pressure, no obligation. Does anyone enjoy a specific variety of apple? Um, there was one when I lived in the U.S. that I really, really enjoyed, but I think it's called Honeycrisp. But at, at this point, I, I think we, we basically just buy Pink Ladies because that's the only one I recognize. Sugar beet apples do, do sound good. Granny Smith apples are delicious as well. I, I like that they're like a, a tinge sour, you know, just like a, a tiny bit. Pink ladies are pretty good. I'd never had them before I moved here, but I recognized the name. That's why I got them. But they're not, they're not bad. Ambrosia apples. I've never heard of ambrosia. You guys are making me feel like I'm ha I'm missing out, you know? Like I don't have all these fancy apples where I live. I like envy and jazz. Sometimes I'll get the cosmic crisp if there's nothing else taking up the grocery budget that that week. Oh yeah, that makes so so much sense to me, Chibi. Also, hi Chibi. I hope that you are having a wonderful wonderful day. Chibi, if you haven't seen it already, we are working on an auto storage system and I want to show you just because, you know, you, you're basically part of the furniture around this stream. Um, so we have a little input chest over here and that will automatically sort all of the items um, 
with this very fancy redstone that I totally made up myself. It's patented. Yes, yes, indeed. No, I'm just kidding. And um, this is what it's looking like so far. Obviously, I left room up there to decorate and like put leaves and all that kind of stuff for later. But this is um, this is how it's looking. I'm really, really liking it. I hope you also like it very much. Yeah, no, that's true, Lawrence. You you do live in an area that has like a lot of delicious apple varieties. We have um we had a lot of those where I used to live as well, like a lot of different apples. Um But where I live now, we don't we don't have as many. But that's okay, you know? What should I add as a building to my fairy kingdom? Um obviously like a very pink like princess tower. Yo, Abby, welcome in. How are you doing, Abby? Hope you're doing well today. That should be more than enough to finish up through here. Oh, not this one. My goodness. Oh, wait, did I not? chat <laughs> chat who was gonna tell me that i didn't even finish i didn't even finish this hello chat you were like all right no one tell her let's see if she notices on her own but that's not finished wait 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 okay do you guys think that i should round off the the end with this no, I think I think leaving it like that is probably better in case we need to expand someday. Never mind. Never mind. Does anyone else just go get some lettuce to munch on? Not usually by itself. Although I do munch on veggies sometimes, you know what I mean? Like if I have veggies in my fridge, I will have veggies as like a snack. It wasn't finished. No, <laughs> it, it needed some stairs and trapdoors. It's OK, chat. I forgive you this this once. My partner does that with cabbage? Oh, that's interesting. Soon we won't have to, Oh my god, you know what I just realized? We have to place upside down upside down stairs on the top parts as well. But at least there we have a block to put them on, so it'll be a little bit easier. Well, not right there, but... The homegrown lettuce we grew? I'm more of a... Yeah, I love carrots. Carrots are so good. I like carrots. I really like like broccoli as well like as a snack broccoli and um tomatoes and cucumber like i'll just make like a little veggie platter for myself you know what i mean Oh my gosh, Lawrence, I'm so jealous. I keep telling Glygoth that we should run away into the woods and, and make carrots. And by make carrots, I obviously mean grow them. I don't mean make them out of nothing. Like clay carrots or something, you know what I mean? I am very normal and I can be trusted around the carrots. Can you explain how some people hate tomatoes but love ketchup? 
Um, I don't really know how that happens, but I will say I am the kind of person that does not like ketchup, but I love tomatoes. Tomatoes, hot peppers, and potatoes. Oh my gosh, yes. I always wanted to try cucumbers for pickles and they always get moldy. Oh no. Oh, I guess that's why it looks a little bit strange up here. This is not fully done. Okay, that is one block above. I might have to go get more frog lights. If we're going up to the surface, we're going to chop some dark oak wood as well. There's a ton of sugar in ketchup. Oh, that could be it. Ketchup has more tomato er, ingredients than just tomato. That's that's real. I don't know. I've never been like a person that likes a lot of condiments. You know what I mean? Like I've never really liked mayo or ketchup or sometimes I'm like okay with mustard and mayo if it's like a really light amount, but I still don't like ketchup. Whose idea did uh, you get about building an automated storage? Um, I mean, the idea to build it was my own. Like I, um, I, I really just wanted to try to build one. I've never built one before. Um, but there's, I got inspiration from Infinite Drift, Mr. Beardstone. Um, I learned about the system and how to build it from, um, from, sorry. Oh my gosh, I'm blanking on his name. Pixel riffs. Sorry, chat. Oh my gosh. I've literally only been... I have been doing this today for like over 12 hours, so my, my brain is melted. Oh, the cucumber plant itself gets moldy. I see, I see. I know for me with tomatoes, it's a mixture of texture along with specific varieties. Yeah, that's true. Texture is a huge thing for a lot of eaters and that, that like makes total sense. I have too many condiments in my fridge. Oh no. I don't know. I've just never been a condiment person. All right, let's grab a shulker box. Um, what was I gonna go get? What did I say we needed to get? Frog lights, frog lights, and we're going to farm some, some dark oak wood. And you know what? Since we're going upstairs, we might as go well go mend our pickaxes as well. Does that sound good for everybody? Is everybody comfy and cozy with that? Frog lights. Let's grab the frog lights first. Wow. 
Also, I hope you guys like the design of the storage system. Um, if you guys have any suggestions or any ideas for like what can go in the top in the decorations part, I can show you guys what um, I had in my like flat world. Um, so in my flat world, this is this is how I built it basically to make sure that it would work and like look good. Sweetheart, I do stream on Twitch. I stream Monday, Sunday, and Friday. On Wednesday nights, I stream over here on YouTube. But so this is how it um, is eventually going to look somewhat like this. Um, so this is like, obviously this still needs some work, some like smoothing. It doesn't look 100% right, but that's okay. Like no one's going to be looking at that. I think. Um, but this is the kind of idea I had for this like stuff up here. Like we could put like bookshelves and little flower boxes and stuff like that. You know, just like little lights and. No, you're good, sweetheart. All good. But if you guys have any ideas for any of these like upper boxes, let me know as well. This is how it'll eventually look once I'm done, once I'm done building and uh, there'll be like a gradient from stone all the way down into quartz and then it'll kind of like tailor off into like the mangrove and then come down and this is, this is how it'll look. Sort of sort of how it'll look. <laughs> Shay says, oh my god, first time catching one of your streams. I love you so much. Hi, welcome in. We're doing well. Welcome to the stream. I have severe chronic migraines with other health problems. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. I'm glad that the streams are able to be there for you and, and comfort you and, you know, be there to play along with you. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much for being here and for for saying that. That's very sweet of you. At first I thought you would just yeet your stuff into the pond. Yeah, I haven't quite figured out the input chest yet. Um, but it won't be yeeted into the pond, I promise. It's so pretty and I've been using sniffer eggs as lamps recently and it looks really nice. But wouldn't a sniffer still hatch even if it's not on moss? That's the only thing I worry about is that... Like I wouldn't want a sniffer to just be running amok, you know what I mean? Lots of love to you too, Shay. Oh, we should definitely make some of those like fancy pots, you know, with like the, the sherds. We'll definitely get some of those up there. Oh, love to Dorito. Oh my gosh, that is so sweet. So um, we are currently working on our hardcore Minecraft world uh, storage system. This is for the upcoming video that I'm working on. Um, it is, oh, it's also day 800 chat. Let's go. Let's go, we did it! This is my longest ever hardcore world ever, ever, ever. Emotional damage lore world three. You might recognize that world if we went in there, Chibi. I went in there today to look at something and I was hit with the feels. Teresa, welcome back, welcome back. You can tell entire stories with pottery shards, pots. Yeah, that's so awesome, I love that. I miss the lore world, I do too. Someone asked me today if I if I had ever died there and I was like, no, I'm, I'm still alive there. And they were like, well, what happened? And then I had like, I explained that like I retired the world because I retired like I, I was streaming this on Twitch, this world, but then um, then we started playing Vault Hunters and then, you know, computer broke. 
I'm not a Harry Potter fan, no, Serena. Yo, Tanko Berry. Hello, hello. I definitely want to do like chiseled bookshelves up there. I think we can also do probably some like of the fancy decorative player heads that we have. We have like a data pack that lets us get player heads. Like I think we could get like books and potion stuff. That would be really magical. Yo cutie, welcome back. Wait, cutie, I, or Kudakor, I, I meant to ask you, do I pronounce your name correctly? Is it, is it supposed to be like cutie or is it ku like cootie? What shaders do you use? I use a complimentary shaders. Can I call for a hydration check? Absolutely. Alfie, you're so right. That's the one thing that I really wish Twitch had or YouTube had. I really wish they had channel points so we could hydrate. Everyone make sure you hydrate, not just me. If I'm the only hydrator, I'm gonna be very sad. Noah says, hello frog, hello chat. Just finished 73 questions of my assessment. I'm so ready to relax in the stream. Oh my gosh. Well, I hope the assessment goes well when you find out the results. Oh my goodness. Congratulations on getting through that. And I hope you're able to relax and just hang out, have a snack, play some Minecraft if that's your thing and just vibe. I can finally hydrate together with you guys. Oh my gosh, yes, let's go. All right, everyone, make sure you hydrate. I hydrated. I'm drinking ice water right now. I don't know why, but whenever I'm streaming or like recording, ice water like hits different. I think it's because it gets so warm in my room with my computer on. Queen Minty, hello, hello. Is that a diva profile picture? I love your profile picture so much. When I played Overwatch, I was um I was definitely a diva main. Well. I, I, I flexed, but D.Va was my main tank for sure. Meds check too while we're at it. So true. Actually, you know, let's do a general self care check. Has everyone had something to eat today? Taking your meds, drank water, you know, make sure, make sure you do those things. Chat. It's very, very important. Take care of yourself, take care of your body, especially you're here among friends and we're all here to help each other get through it. Yo, Lauren, nice to see you over here on YouTube as well. Welcome in. It's your lucky week. It's my lucky week to have you here as well. I hope you had a good week since we last saw each other over on Twitch. I'm drinking normal water. Normal water is also delicious. I only have one beverage on my desk today and I'm just proud of myself. Okay, Alfie, I thought of you this morning because my partner was in the kitchen with me and I was getting like my coffee and I had, you know, a little like cold iced coffee that he bought me from the store and I had my water and I had something else. And he was like, are you taking all four of those drinks upstairs? And I was like, yes, I need them. And he was like, oh, okay. like. I'm just going to mind my business now. And I was like, as you should. <laughs> Most of the time I have two drinks, sometimes three, but rarely four. Oh, it's nighttime. We should probably go sleep because I'm definitely going to have phantoms spawning.
Wait, hold on. Like for for was was like my stream down for you guys because it said like I had a connection error to chat for over two minutes. And I was like, that's why I was, I was kind of quiet. I was like, am I, am I still live? Hello? No worries, Ari the Dragon. Have a good one. I don't know if I'm back or if I was even gone. Sorry if I was, if I like, if stream crashed or something. No? Okay, okay. Glee, for, from my end, from my end, I had no chat messages and it said like, you've been disconnected. And I was like, huh? It was, uh, it was weird, but I think it was just like a little YouTube glitch. Oh, okay. So it stopped working for you guys as well. Okay. Cause I was like, um, did like my stream crash or something? Like, why did that happen? Anyways, um, so let me, let me catch up on chat here. Cause I, I didn't catch up for about two minutes. Um, stretch and posture too. Right. Absolutely. Alfie says a stretch and a posture check. Everyone make sure you stretch. Make sure you check your posture. If you're shrimping, try to sit up. I need to buy a new nice water bottle, but I haven't um, done it yet. Yeah, no, Lawrence, having having a water bottle has really helped me. Like a nice water bottle has really helped me drink more water. I drink two liters of water a day now. Yo, Starflame, good morning. Welcome in. I just got a package of some art supplies. I had to leave back at my parents' house when I moved out. Oh my gosh, let's go, Lauren. Congrats on getting the art supplies. I hope that you're able to make all the, the amazing art, whatever kind of supplies you got, whether it was paints or, you know, oil pastels or, or whatever it is. Yo, Gokusid, hello, hello, welcome in. Next week it's five drinks, so true. When are you gonna do a face reveal? I probably never will. Um, but I'll let you guys know if I ever want to. What's the plan um, for today's Minecraft? New build or something? We're working on an automated storage system. I just needed to uh, chop some dark oak trees and we have to go repair our tools. Uh, not these ones, the ones in our ender chest. You should get air up. I've had an air up before. It was pretty nice. They don't make them in like 50 ounces though, I don't think. But air up was pretty good. I genuinely enjoyed having one. Lately I've been kind of like on a plain water, but like with ice kick. I like flavored water too, or like the, I guess it was plain water, but it thought that it had flavor because of like the smell. It was different for sure. I think we still have refills for those bottles in our, <laughs> in our closet, babe. I use Simply Modern. Shay, that's the one that I use. I have two of them. I, um, and then I just like swap them out. I keep them clean until I like, you know, I use it for like two days. Then I clean it, swap to the other one in the meantime. You know what I mean? Kareen, hello, hello, welcome in. How you doing? How do you get the strawberry hunger bar? It's a, it's a texture pack. It's called froggy hot bar. Bye Nicole. Have a good one. Yo, Haley, welcome in. How you doing? Like the circles. Oh, bro, come on. You're gonna really make me do this in front of my stream.
Okay, sorry. Sorry, chat. Just had to talk to my partner really quick. The All the texture packs are linked in the description as well. What mod are you using? I'm not. I, I'm not playing modded. I'm just using a texture pack. I'm also working on my storage system right now. Let's go, Mia. I hope it goes well. I was not expecting you to set them on fire. Yeah, I don't want to start a raid. I really don't want to fight a raid right now. <laughs> I'm not mentally prepared for a raid. I'm not going to lie. So um, not getting bad omen is the the vibe. Um, especially because I have villagers in my house and there are villagers right here. So no bad omen for me, please. Oh, we don't we really don't need those. Um You know, and you'd think after they see this one here that I've already placed, like they would they would just stay away, but they don't. Wimscape is my favorite texture pack right now. I really like Wimscape as well. I played a lot with that one in the better Chad uh or Big Chad Guys Plus whatever mod pack. Um with like the cobble bond and stuff. I really enjoyed that texture pack. I really like the font on it as well. It's very, I mean, it's whimsical, of course. It's very pretty. I play on peaceful these days, so I never know. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, that's, that's why I killed them with fire. If I had a lava bucket, I could have also used that. Um, some people will get them to shoot each other. Um, so you stand in front of the one pillager captain and then you make the other ones shoot the, the captain that's also a pretty valid strategy is this a world you get a totem every hundred days every thousand days i'm allowed to fight a raid but yes chibi every 1000 days i'm allowing myself to fight a raid in this um world so we're almost we're 200 days until i can fight another one But I still have all of the totems for my first raid. Um, I have not. I have not died. So, we're Gucci. How are you today? I'm doing great. How are you? I wish I could build like you. You absolutely could. You just gotta practice. Practice and use references and ask people for feedback. Those are the best ways to get better. Yeah, no, no, you're good. You're good. You're good, Chibi. You you were right about the you you had the right idea, you know? You were right about the world. I wasn't going to use totems at all in this world, but then Twitch chat convinced me to use totems. Because they were like, oh my god, frog, if you lose this world, we are gonna riot. But I was only gonna play with a shield until we got the totems. Who's your favorite Minecraft YouTuber? Or who's my favorite YouTuber? Um I don't know. I watch a lot of different people. Yeah, no worries, uh, Herzen. Thank you for asking as well. Glad to hear that you're doing good. Tutorials are a great way to learn. Yeah, tutorials are a good way to get down, like, a lot of principles of, like, how people build. I, I used to follow tutorials all the time, and every once in a while, I'll, I'll look at tutorials to see how people do things. I definitely think that to grow you you have to like eventually move on to like your own designs or like trying your own designs but there's nothing wrong when you're first learning with like you know practicing with tutorials and stuff what is modded minecraft long play or live coming um i i literally just posted a video like last week And um, as long as I make good progress on this world, I will be doing another um, modded stream next week on Wednesday. But um, next week, we'll, if, if we get enough progress in this world, so basically like the modded world, um, just so you guys know, the modded world is more for like 
when I don't have stuff to do in my main world. This is my main world. This will always be the world that I'm like the most attached to and the most like I want to do the most in. Um, the modded world is just for fun and it's something that we can sort of like do on stream together. Um, and we will play there a lot when I don't have stuff to do in this world. But when we have stuff like digging, that's what that's what I'm focusing on today. I feel like that is fair. But I'm only one little froggy and um, I got to try my best to make videos one at a time. Frog crafting is definitely my favorite YouTuber. Are you when blueprint is right there, you're going to say frog crafting. <laughs> Roblox girl. Hello. Hello. Almost two hours on stream. Oh my gosh. Has it really been two hours already? All right, chat, everyone, everyone just chill. No one look at any Enderman. <gasps> Wait, where's our homeboy? Hello? Where's the zombie piglin at? <gasps> Do you guys think he looked at an Enderman? Oh man. What was his name, chat? Oh my gosh, I remember that we named him, but I don't remember his name. He was in... Yeah, Steps, welcome in. This is our non-modded world. This is our long-term hardcore world. We had a, we had a zombie piglin here in the end that was just chilling, but I don't know where he went. All right, chat, it's gonna get a little bit loud. I will turn down the volume, don't worry. And we're gonna, we're gonna heal up our, our pickaxes. Also, I, I know that there's, there's a lot of, um, there's a lot of stuff going on over here. Bye, Karines. Have a good one. How did he get in here? From the nether. So I have a nether portal into my stronghold. And he just walked in there from the nether portal, I think. I looked at an enderman. Oh, no. This makes me want to play vanilla now. Oh, my gosh. Wait, the steps. Did you see the, the rest of the world? I can show you after we're done. Um, We've been working on this world for about a year i'd say but on and off um there are some times where i have to delay projects and also my computer was broken for like six months um and then you know there was another point where i had to take a small break for like health reasons so a lot of stuff that has happened through our time But yeah, I'll show you as soon as we're done healing up our, our pickaxes. Since we had to leave the cave anyways, we might as well have made a stop here. And we actually built this as well on stream. If you guys haven't seen the live stream VOD, if you guys want to learn how to build this, um, there is a VOD of this uh, Enderman farm that you can make yourself as well. It's um pretty, it's really, really easy. It's just very scary, obviously being over the void. <gasps> There's an Enderman head. I want that. We can put that in the storage room. Oh, bro. I made friends with an enderman. My boyfriend helped me tame with a bow and name tag. Oh no, that's 
that's so sad. I'm so sorry to hear about your Enderman friend. Um, getting, getting, um, unfortunately, um, unfortunately ended. Do you know what happened to him? Like, how did he get out of the boat? Where's the head? Oh, chat as well. We While we're here, we also have to breed some axolotls. The little Dorito barks, I know. Okay. There we go, chat. So I haven't built anything in the end yet. I'm I'm planning uh, to build something cool here eventually. I just don't know what. Um, I don't know if I'll do any like mega builds in the end or anything. I don't know if I'll like remove the whole end island, but uh, eventually we will build something there. Um, just to show our area really quick. This is the rosewood. This is the area that we've been building up for like the last year on and off. Um, this is our starter house over here. Um. I spent like 70 days building this house. It took me forever. <laughs> Were you able to get the head? I did. I got three of them. Um, after we built our starter house, we also built, hold on one second. Let me go out. Of, let me exit free cam. Just put these, this back on just so we're a little bit more protected. Um, we built an iron farm after that. Um, this is, this is where we get all of our iron for our world. Then we had like a little pumpkin, like a magical pumpkin part of a stream for Halloween in 2022. Um, so that this has been a, a world for, you know, just over a year. Um, then we have our blacksmith with a super smelter in it. We have a wool farm over here in like a big barn. And all the sheep are up there just having their wool shared. We have a little cactus farm here underneath the ground. And then we have um, a sugarcane farm as well, where, where I'm currently standing. This, um, this is a little bee farm that we made. And then we have a tree farm over there. Um, and way over here in the spawn area, we have like a museum for like all of the, the relics that we have in our world. And then we have a Christmas cottage over here. We have a mob farm. And um, what we're working on today is actually a um, a auto sorted uh, or an auto sorting storage system. I gotta go. Bye. No worries. Have a good one. And this is um, this is the project that we're working on today. Well. I've been working on this for about 12 hours today and also like eight hours yesterday and about five hours the day before and like eight hours on Saturday. <laughs> it's, it's been quite a process. I'm not going to lie. Um, but here's our auto storing storage so far. We have like our nature wing with like logs and flowers and all that stuff. And then we have like the stone and all of that kind of stuff, sand, clay, skull, nether, and all that kind of stuff is in this one. And then this is the wing we're currently building. Like we, we mined all of this out, by the way, on stream today, like from like past this point, we mined all of that out on stream today. Um, and this is going to be for all the colorful blocks. Like think about like wool, terracotta, glazed terracotta, concrete, all that kind of stuff, glass. Thanks so much, Leon. And thanks so much, Steps, as well. Yeah, no worries, some artist. Enjoy your lurk. 
You need a goth tower. So we do have a spot for a tower. Um, let's free cam up there. Sorry, I don't want to like actually go up there. Right here, I'm gonna build some sort of like watchtower overlooking like the pond. Um, like very like think about the like if the style of like the long plays, on uh, the ones without commentary. Um, let me show you guys. Hold on, we can fly up out of here. Like it's very like this inspired right here. Cause I really, I really like this tower and um, not everyone has seen this video, but I, I really, really, I loved this tower so much. I was so proud of this. I gotta go eat and then I have to do homework. Yeah, no worries. Have a good one. Thank you so much for being here. Good luck with the, the homework. I hope you have some good food and have a good day. I'm working and watching. No, oh my gosh. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. Especially while you're working. That is dedication. Yeah, so it's going to be something kind of inspired by this, but obviously a little bit more like Rosewood style. And and taller. I want it to be taller because that's the one thing I think the Rosewood kind of lacks is like height variation. Um, A lot of things are kind of either short or like similar heights. And obviously we've added a couple of like tower roofs and like, you know, a large chimney and stuff. But on this side, it's all very kind of like similar heights on sight lines. So I think something tall here is gonna be like, draw your eye. But yeah, that's a eventual plan. I made a house inspired by that tower. Have you showed me that? I would love to see that. If you want to share, of course. If it's private, you don't have to. Alright, and we can go over here. And we I'm so excited about just putting stuff in this barrel. Because once we put stuff in this barrel, it'll just start filtering through the system. And so all that dark oak that we chopped, we'll see coming into the chests. Look at that, it's filling on its own. I didn't have to put it anywhere. Are you guys proud of me? I've been working really, really hard on this. I promise, like I've been, <laughs> I've been working so hard. I've never done anything like this before in Minecraft. It's my first ever time and I'm very happy with it. I'm so relaxed right now, nice, let's go. We love a little bit of relaxing. Oh, whoops. I supposed to do here I guess like this we'll create chests for all the blocks and items in the game I'm not gonna do every single block and item um I'm mainly doing the ones that I collect a lot of um but like under I have a um I have space underneath like because I'm never gonna need like to sort like oak buttons you know what i mean I, I just don't think that there's like a point in adding hoppers for like oak buttons um so underneath like my oak chest let me show you you could find it angel if you just search like automated storage system here on youtube you'll be you'll be able to find a bunch of them that can help you so let's take for instance like my oak uh fence gates and my oats oak stairs so over here are for like oak logs and like bulk um, oak if I have like shulker boxes or also stripped. And then over here I have auto sorted or oak planks. But in this one, I'm just gonna be doing like all the like the random craftables. 
So like oak stairs, trap doors, because I never have more than a stack of those. Did you make this design up? This is my design, yeah. It's my original design. It was inspired by Infinite Drift um, and Mr. Beardstone a little bit and, you know. Um, but it's not like a one-for-one -one copy of either one of their designs. I, I still, like, put in my own spin on it. Wrong thing. Okay. Trap doors over the lights so they're not as bright on our face. Yeah, so there will be some manual sorting involved in this uh, storage system. Um, but most of it will be auto sorted and then the rest I'll just do on my own. And I'm fine with that. I think it'll save in the long run on some hopper lag, you know? Because that's something I'm I'm trying to be very cautious of. Shoot, how did this how did this work? Why do I feel like that whole line is one block too high? Am I silly or is it one block too high? No, it's all the same. So next to the trap doors. Oh, there's supposed to be stairs there. That's right. I'm just missing part of the storage over there. That's why it looks a little bit weird. Make a village of pink tree. I mean, I'm not really looking for suggestions right now for what to build. I'm kind of just doing my own thing, you know? Maybe someday though. Chat, I mined this whole thing pretty incorrectly. Oops. Is this the most complex thing you've ever built? Yeah. For sure. There's a there's a lot of um there there's a lot of parts in, involved in this. <laughs> I wasn't going to decorate my storage, but now I kind of want to. Oh my gosh, you absolutely should. Like I will say it's it's worth the effort if you can expend the effort if that makes sense. Like, I'm not going to lie, I wasn't very excited about this and now I'm seeing how it all kind of like comes together and looks together and I'm so happy that I'm doing it this way. Oh, bruh. Gotta go. No worries, Harzen. Have a good one. Thanks for vibing. Yeah, it like it hurts the brain a little bit. I'm not gonna lie, but it's okay. I'm actually just really happy that I can do work like with y'all here on stream because I um I was going a little bit um bananas earlier by myself. I was singing really loud and really off key. And it was it was not it was not fun. It was if it's fun for no one involved. Especially Dorito. He was like, please, mom, please stop. 
I'll do anything. You made food? Nice. What did you make? The weather in Cali right now is not it. What? It, what's uh? What's going on over there? That should go back in here. That way I know where it is. Um, we'll do some slabs. Actually, I think we're gonna need a little bit more than that. I need some mangrove one as well. Do I have any mangrove slabs left? And I have four planks. Well, that's not really a lot. Okay, that's good enough for now. It's been raining hard and the wind has been... Oh, wow. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. I hope everyone's okay over there. That's always scary when there's like flooding and stuff. I mean, you should know... There's no mod pack, just some texture packs and they're linked in the description. The, uh, the weather in Ohio today is it. Let's go. It's 55. That probably feels like summer there after, you know, having a winter. Oh, you made ramen? Nice. Yeah, it's been a really weird winter here in the Netherlands as well. Normally we have like a tiny bit of snow and we had snow one time and it was like, like for all my Americans, there was like an inch of snow on the ground. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. It was like the least amount of snow I've ever seen. And I'm, I'm from New York, so I'm pretty used to like a ton of snow. It's just like very, very strange to not have like any snow. I had pasta and garlic bread. Oh my gosh, that sounds amazing. Pasta and garlic bread, top tier combination. Yo, Elsia, welcome in. Or Eliza, is that Eliza? Sorry, I, I read that a little bit wrong. I hope that's correct now. Ugh, we're stuck. It was just negative 20 in Michigan. Oh my gosh. That is extremely cold. I don't want to sleep. I want to look for red mushroom blocks, but I don't think I have any down here. I think it's all down here now. Two foot of snow over the whole season. That's pretty low for like New York. You know what I mean? My dad can pick me up from school. If not, then I'd be dying in the rain on the way home. That's true. We weren't in the negative, but it was in the tens. Yeah, we've we've had weather quite cold. Like it's been that cold here, but it hasn't snowed. What Minecraft series is that? This is my hardcore series. Did you go to did the deep cage for redstone on hardcore? Yep. I um I included in the video a uh, like a little mining session. You guys will see it when the the video fully comes out. Yeah, it do it just doesn't snow here. It's very weird. What's your favorite snack? I'm definitely a chips girl, but also I love to snack on like fruits and veggies too.
you said you were in New York. I, I'm from New York, but I don't live there now. I don't live in New York anymore. I live in Europe now. That always, I feel like that always ha happens to me on Halloween when I lived in the U.S. as well, Alfie. The last time I, I did a Halloween in the U.S. though, like, there was, like, no, there was, like, no trick-or-treaters. I was so sad. Like, I was there with my bowl of candy. I was dressed up. I was, like, ready to see all the costumes. And, like, no one came. Like, two kids. And I was like, oh, okay. Well, I guess I have all this candy to eat now. What's your favorite Pringles favor flavor? I like the spicy ones. How much do you plan on doing the cosmetic part and the redstone part um, for tonight's stream? I probably won't get to the redstone part tonight. We only have like 45 minutes left of stream. So I'm just like placing blocks until I run out. I can do um I can do a redstone bit if you guys want to see that though. I just have to craft a bunch of stuff. But that's no issue. I think we have most of the things that we need. What's your spice tolerance? Um I like spicy food. I like pretty spicy. We had kids, it just started out a beautiful night, but around 7.15 it just turns into a blizzard. Oh my gosh. That's also so scary for like, you know, like you're like wondering if the kids are like cold and stuff out there. Uh, oh yeah, YouTube streams are three hours usually. I don't mind doing a little bit longer sometimes, but today, um, today we're going to be pretty strictly three hours. Just because I want to see something outside of blocks. I've been in the block game today for about 12 hours. <laughs> My favorite ramen in the Bulldog, or is the Bulldog Cheesy Carbonara. I um I really like the Bulldog ramen as well. I, I like the double spicy. I've eaten the triple spicy as well, although that did make me cry. I would do it again though. But I, I really like that. Like that level of spice is like perfect for me. Yo, Taiga, welcome in. Doritos doing good. Hope you're also doing good. The hotter, the better for me. Yeah, like I, I really like that feeling on your like lips afterwards, like that, like when it's spicy and your like lips still feel like the spicy. Does that make sense? Oh, right. Didn't I, like, block this off on the other one? Hold on. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. I meant to do this. There was, like... Yeah, we did something like that. And then there was stairs. I need to go get more stairs. Yeah, it's like a tingly feeling. Thank you for saying tingly. I couldn't think of the word. What tips would you give to survive in a hardcore world in the early stages? Get a bucket of water and get a shield ASAP. And villager trade. There's nothing wrong with villager trading to get armor instead of caving. Personally, if I could start every hardcore world with a village nearby, I would.
All right. So we'll just ignore that for now, okay? It's not perfect, but it's there. I think we're going to end up running out of red mushroom block, though, on this, like, round. So I'm going to have to farm more tomorrow. Any build ideas I can get from my Minecraft world? I want to build something since I need more ideas. Um, this is, I'm just throwing this out there. I, I feel like we should all build more custom trees. It's mainly because I have to build custom trees and I really want to like get inspiration from you guys. <laughs> I, I don't want to do it on my own chat. Oh, I think I do have Podzol. I, yep. All right, let's grab a little bit of red mushroom block. I don't have that many red mushrooms, hello? good at building anything but I can't build custom trees well it sounds like it's a good time to start I'm gonna be building some custom trees in the rosewood pretty soon in a video and I'm a little bit scared oh also we need these and do I have sweet berries no that's something we still haven't found we don't have sweet berries but that's okay what did I come up here for Oh, an axe. Just like regular iron axe. Do I have a diamond one? Um, I thought I did, but apparently I don't. Maybe it's over in the villager cave. Yo, apple juice. Hello, hello. No, I, th this is all the red mushrooms that I have right now is only four. So I'm going to have to, I'm going to have to like bone meal a couple of red mushrooms up and then like get them with a, like an ax, but my ax has silk touch on it. So I'm just trying to find, I had another ax. Yeah, it's this one right here. Um, while I'm here, I might as well trade with my villagers. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Time for a mid-afternoon bowl of cereal. That sounds good. Oh, wait. There's some spruce wood here. I'm taking that. It's just thinking of the blocks that's hard. That's true. That's true. It's definitely a skill you have to learn. I got a 90 on all my midterm tests. Let's go. Controversial opinion, but terraforming is so fun. I don't think that's controversial. I think terraforming is fun. I think it can be difficult at times, but I usually enjoy it. All right, so what, what I need to do is I need to basically just chop a bunch of these to get more red mushrooms. See, like we already have 10. And then I can take the mushroom stem. I do want that. 
I had to farm that one day for hours for the museum build. That was not fun. We'll just bone meal and then we'll grab some more. All right, so there's that one. Another iron ax. Take those. We just watched Bullet Train. It was a bit gory for Lona States, but other than that, it was really fun. Nice. Nice, quiet little movie night. Well, I guess if it was gory, it was maybe not the best. <laughs> Lona, hi, lovely. How are you doing? Nice to see you. Thank you so much, Eliza. I appreciate that. I've run out of red mushroom block completely, so I have to farm up some little, the tiny red mushrooms so I, then I can silk touch them. That's what we're currently working on, but progress update for Lona. Um, we've got a lot of the decorative part of the this hallway in, so obviously just filling in that top bit, and I, I obviously have to fill in the stairs here still the movie was good but i looked away a lot yeah 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 and we mined out we mined out this as well <laughs> we mined out the whole thing um for all of like the the concrete terracotta glass and wool <sighs> this is it's a lot it's yo charlotte hello it, it's a lot we're, we're getting there though the, i can see the finish line at least through the digging portion after today's stream and it was it honestly went just so fast 57 is enough we can just uh keep all of this now You don't have to go to a, straight to a fancy and expensive college unless you know for sure that you want to be something that requires education like a doctor or a lawyer. So true. No worries, chocolate. I hope that you had a good nap. It's okay to work for a bit and go to community college or trade school. So true. So true. It's hard to think about making life decisions when sometimes I can't even figure out what outfit I want to wear. You know what I mean? So like deciding your whole life, you know, sometimes, sometimes it's a really, really big decision and there, it's, it's like so fine to take your time on that decision as well. Thanks, Leon. I appreciate that. I woke up early for school, but I don't feel good, so I decided to stay home. Well, I hope that you feel better soon, Charlotte. We hate we hate to hear that you're not feeling well. I'm only going to a college place just for the esports. I heard that they were doing that there, so I'm thinking of doing it for that. Nice, nice. What game? That one was just being a little bit stubborn. All right, there we go. Lots of progress made today. I feel like I'm gonna be seeing breaking blocks in my sleep or in my sleep though. I'll be like mining stone in my sleep, you know? My goodness. Did we get it all? We did. I haven't heard yet, but I hope it's something fun like an FPS game. Yeah. I hope so as well. 
no matter what it is, I hope you guys have a good time with it. No, Chibi, I agree. As an adult who was told to go to college and then I, I haven't used my degree. Um, it's pretty, uh, well, I, I used it a little bit, but, um, definitely I was part of like, you know, no one in my family had gone to college, so no one had like real experience with like making, you know, I couldn't really make an informed decision. I didn't have anyone to inform me or to inform me. And I was like, I was only 16 when I was like, you know, signing up for like school and stuff. So I feel like I made a lot of choices very young that I probably wouldn't have made the same choices today, but I mean, who knows? How are you getting upstairs? What do you mean? Are you and your friends going to make Minecraft videos together? You mean like um, me and Sev and Drift and, and Brooke and Red and I, I don't know if we're making anything new this year. Maybe. I forgot when we were talking about apples earlier to ask, but have you ever had an apple cider bubbly? I don't think I ever have, but that sounds good. Charlotte, I'm a little bit confused. What do you mean? Like, how are we getting up here? What's your favorite mob? Um, definitely Minecraft bees. I also like Minecraft cats because I, they don't make me sneeze. Oh, back up to the house? Um, you, you fly up the tunnel. I'll show you. You have to have an elytra to get in and out of this place. But I probably will, I probably will put a, um, a water elevator somewhere in, like, the corner. Um, like, hidden. But currently, this is the only entrance right now. It works for now. Not not a bad thing. I mean, I could leave this one water spot in the middle and then have the rest fence gated. Once I make the pond up here, that will like cover the entrance. Um, but yeah, that's how you get in and out. Have you ever had boba tea? I have, but I'm not a big fan of boba bubble, like the bubbles. You know what I mean? Like the, what, what are they called? The tapioca? It's a texture thing for me. I liked the actual like stuff with it, except for like the tapioca stuff. The, like the pearls or whatever they're called. Bye Serena, have a good one. Yeah, it was very nice to see you. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Oh, whoops. Kimberly, hello. Please don't spam.
Please don't spam. The ones that pop are better. But I feel the texture issues. I do always ask for light on the bubbles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It wasn't like I didn't have a boba shop where I used to live. So I'd never been able to try it until I moved. And when I tried it, like it was it was fine. Like it was it was not my favorite thing, but it was also not the worst thing. And I, I think it was just because I have like weird texture preferences. No worries, Glagoth. Guys, I will respond to your message in chat. Please just don't spam. I do my best. Sometimes I might miss something and then, you know, it's all right if you repeat it, but don't spam. What even is boba tea? It's a milk tea, usually, with like um, tapioca balls in it. I love your builds. Thank you, Kimberly. I appreciate that. That is very kind. closest boba shop near me is an hour away yeah so i lived um i lived like in very like upstate new york like across the lake from canada kind of new york when uh like before i moved so there was just no boba shops anywhere near me that was like a pretty new thing for me to try once i moved here all right chat we're gonna make some redstone components which is basically going to be me using all my spruce wood for some for some hoppers. Oh. Um Wait, how am I going to do this? Oh, I guess I guess it'll have to be like that for <laughs> for the cocoa beans. All right, let's grab that bag. We'll have to put something there. Um, cocoa beans right there. Do you play any other games? Um, I play a lot of Valorant and I'm currently playing Stardew Valley over on Twitch as well. How much do you know about Redstone? Absolutely nothing. We had zero and then two opened up within four months of each other. Oh, nice. I don't care for the uh, boba in tea, but I don't mind it as a topping in froyo or smoothie bowls. Oh my gosh, smoothie bowls are my favorite thing in the entire world. I'm not gonna lie. Anyone else play Dreamlight Valley? I have it, but I haven't played before. I just don't, I, I just don't have the time. Redstone is red. That's what I know. <laughs> True. That is about my redstone knowledge. Is it a Minecraft day or a Stardew day next stream? I believe it is a Minecraft day. I think you left two chests not connected. I, I thought I did too, Pat. Did I not fix it? I definitely saw that I had that messed up. Hold on, let me go. Let me go look. Thank you for catching that. Yep, there it is. Good eye. And that's today's episode of Big Truths with Gly. <laughs> with with Gliggy. Oh 
Not with Gliggy. Yeah, Charlotte, I think it is a Minecraft day because if I look at my, I'm looking at my notebook right now and at, for like, um, my plan for Friday and it says that I, it's a Twitch hardcore day 14. I owe you guys two paintings and we're going to make a melon and pumpkin farm. Did you hear about the Valorant Valentine's Day bundle? No, I haven't seen that yet. I just saw the, the new bundle for like the new Vandal and knife and stuff. Um, I loved the cinematic that just came out with like ISO and Jet and um, Phoenix. It was so, so fun. I, I always like lie to myself and I'm like, oh, I could just get the bundle and then that'll like help my aim. You know what I mean? But instead um and, well chat that's it's never helped me but i'm gonna keep buying them though you know what i mean <laughs> listen okay no one no one fight me on my delusions have you ever played end ending or endling i don't think i've played that before We are going to do a little bit of redstone today. Don't be scared though, chat. It's fine. I know what I'm doing. I don't. I don't know what I'm doing. I think the Valentine's bundle is free. Oh, like a little event thingy. Oh, I love when they do that. Stone repeaters. Need some more stone for that. Redstone torches are so expensive. Oh my god. What am I missing? Oh, it's just torches, redstone torches. This is basically all the redstone that I have left. If you like mod packs, my boyfriend just showed me a mod where you can customize your elytra like your netherite armor. Oh, that's sick. I'm gonna go try to get some sleep. Yeah, no worries. Have a good one. Sleep well. Oh shoot, I was I was meant to make comparators chat. I made repeaters instead. I mean, we'll use them all, but Oh my god, now I don't have enough stone. We might have to go also mining. Like low key chat, we might have to go mining, but I will probably do that tomorrow. We're not going to do that today. This should be, this should be good. We only have 15 minutes left of stream, so. All right, give me a second. Let me let me clear some of this unneeded stuff out of my inventory. You guys know how it is. Might be making an auto storage system, but I'm still a mess. Bye, Eliza. Have a good one. It's the story of a fox and her cubs trying to survive in the near apocalypse scenario. And one of her cubs was taken by a catcher. Oh, OK, OK. So it's like a story narrative game. That's kind of cool. Yeah, I just don't, I don't have a lot of extra time to play games. Like I, I play Valorant when I can. I try to do my dailies every day, but I don't have fun. I just, I'm just grinding there. 
Um, hoppers, redstone, redstone dust. We, we will need more redstone dust than that. What is your next uh, YouTube live stream? Same time next week on Wednesday. Every Wednesday we live stream here on YouTube. Yeah, sometimes your inventory just gets a little bit messy, you know, That's the, but that's fine. No one's inventory is clean all the time, chat. And if they say that it is, they're lying. I'm sorry. I can't watch most of your live streams. It's okay. No worries if you can't. The VODs will always be there. And I do stream over on Twitch as well. I know not everyone has a Twitch account, but if you guys did ever want to catch the streams on Twitch, you could always watch on there as well. apple juice have a good one also sorry chat i'm a little bit focused on redstone so i don't mess it up if i miss your message it's not intentional oh whoops i don't need one there When you run out of blocks, how do you do the quick grab thing when going into your inventory? It's middle mouse button on Java. That's the default button for it. I thought it only worked in creative, but it works in survival too. I think I'm gonna have to mine this wall. Yep, all right. I built this wall one, one block too close. Oh, I'm sad. I guess we only have to do this like one part right here with like the redstone. The top doesn't matter as much.
What's your favorite food? Tacos, for sure. I managed to update all the resource packs and make them work. Let's go. Love that. Frog hot bar finally. Yeah, let's go. It's like I didn't really know how to do it. I I just um I I googled um <laughs> over here on YouTube how to how to fix the froggy hot bar. Um like how to update it to one how to update like a hot bar texture pack to 120 and um luckily that worked. I tried it for another pack once, but it didn't work. Um but that was like a leaf texture pack and something changed with the leaves. So I don't really know how to fix that, but I started homework and I'm taking a small break. There's a frog outside. Oh my gosh. That's so cool. Say hello to the froggy friend for me. When did I start playing Minecraft? I've been playing Minecraft since, oh my gosh, I don't even know. I think since it was like first out or like in beta, I think I started playing. Oh, a poor Dorito. I think he wants to be in my room. My home screen looks messed up. Oh, you probably have a, a version of Froggy Hopper that has like the, the gooey with it. So I've actually had this hot bar since before it came with the Gooey. That's why mine still looks like Mizuno's. Um, like there was a version of this from like 116.5. That's how long I've had this hot bar. Yo, Redwood, hello, darling. How was your sleep? I, I figured that you were probably asleep earlier. Okay, Hopper is pointing into all of these. Not like that though. Like, oh my gosh, hello? It was good, nice, nice, nice. Are you feeling any better? I know you said that you weren't feeling that well. I did my homework and I'm crocheting a makeup pouch. Nice. That's awesome. No worries, Alfie. Have a good one. Thanks so much for vibing, friend. Hope you have a great week. I hope you're having a good time too. Thank you, Tyga. That's very sweet. That is very, very sweet. We are having, well, I'm having a great time. I am just absolutely vibing. Oh my gosh. What a time. All right, chat. We're going to set our filter items with some sticks that we're going to rename with sub to frog frog crafting lol um this is like a placeholder item that helps control the um the hoppers um amount uh, or sorry the like redstone signal strength i guess you could call it and that goes in the last four slots of all of these like sorting comparator hoppers Again, I don't know how it all works. I just know this is what they said to do.
Oh, also here, let me like turn actually the lights on for you guys because it's probably super dark on this stream. Oh, I need more sticks. Nope, just one of each. All right, let me let me go get more sticks out. She's in her redstone era. She's trying. She's never done anything like this before, so it's a little bit scary, but we're doing it. All right, and then now all that I have to do is put 41 of the items that I actually want to sort in these hoppers. Um, so for instance, if we come to this one right here, we can see, oh, this is the stone hopper. So stone will go in there and then stone will automatically sort itself into the system. So if I put more in there, you'll see it just goes up. What's your favorite texture pack? Definitely the one that I'm using, Mizuno 16 Craft. This one is for cobblestone. This one is stone brick. I think these are mossy, mossy cobble. I don't think I had a lot of that. Oh, I do have enough to do that. Do I have mossy stone brick? I do have mossy stone brick, but not enough. This one is for granite and this one is polished. So as you guys can see, when the, when the number of items in the hopper is over 41, it allows items to move through the hopper. But if I have like only 20 in there, it doesn't empty because the signal is not strong enough. Yeah, it has to do something with like the amount of items in the hopper and like these items help like control the signal or something. I don't 100% know how it works, but that's that's what I know, chat. Why is it exactly 41? I don't know. Well, it's it's 45 items will stay in a hopper. 40, 45 total. But I, I think that's because 45 items in a hopper will emit a redstone signal of three. Or a four, the 46 will make it go to three. So it unlocks the redstone torch. Mia, yeah, it's, this system is not, this, this system doesn't power the, the lines next to it. These, these um, sticks prevent it from powering the line next to it. It only can go to this one right here. It doesn't, it can't go to that one. Oh, I didn't do all these ones. What is this one right here? Jazzy, have a good one. Thanks for hanging out. Hope you have a great rest of your day. Yeah, because these these aren't powering each other. They're just powering themselves. For it to go for it to go to the next line, it would have to be a stronger signal strength. All right, what is next? Oh, I don't know what's down there. Maybe I haven't sorted this area yet.
Oh, right. This, uh, these weren't here before. That's right. And these are placeholders. Okay. So those, those will need a placeholder item. Mainly because where, where we just were next to the end stone, um, all of those are going to be prismarine. Yeah, there's endstone. And where is purple? There we go. My hoppers are emptying at 29. I wonder why yours go to 41. It's because I only have four items in the last four slots. This video from Pixel Riffs is what I watched to learn how to make this system. It's um posted right now in the chat. That's the link. Sorry. Okay. I'm back. Sorry. I had a, I had a very important ping. So for now, those ones are just going to get an extra stick because these sticks will never go through this system. Those are going to be placeholder sticks. I'm going to play on the hive. Yeah, no worries. I mean, I'm, I'm going to be ending stream like very, very soon. So I'm actually over the time that I wanted to go already, but... I just want to get this one more line done. I think I have all of those. We have these and oh, I can't access the barrel. Oh, that's awkward. There we go. Those are all correct. Nice. Ow. Okay, chat. Well, that. No, Chibi. Um, I couldn't get it to work. Um, I couldn't get it to work. So I'm gonna be using a hopper chain with um. With uh, composters on top. I've already started the hopper chain. This this side is all done already. I I did this in like the video part. Like um, I just have to put composters on top of the hoppers. Um, but I'm going to do a hopper chain. I tried to get a water stream with honey blocks and ice and stuff to work, but it just, I got to tell you that was the most, it was so complicated. I would have preferred for that to be the way, but it, it just didn't work. At least how I was doing it. I, it, maybe I could find a, a tutorial or a video that would show me actually how to do it. But I, I was just kind of winging it and it, it did not work. <laughs> but chat, that that is going to be our stream today. We got so much done. I'm actually in shock about how much we have, like how much progress we actually made today between like finishing off most of the, the decorations for like this wing and also mining out and setting up a lot of this on this wing as well. Oh my gosh, we did so much. But that's going to be it for today. I hope you guys had a good time. I had a great time with y'all. We didn't even take a break today. That's how into it we were. Um, but I, I just want to say thank you guys all for tuning in. Um, let me know what you guys thought of the storage system. If you guys want to leave a comment or if you guys have any suggestions, you know, you can always leave them in the comment section. I hope everyone has um, a super, super good day. Thank you for being here. See you guys next week and hopefully also next week will be the video showing this whole process and like the how I built everything and 
yeah then you guys could be in the comments on the video and be like i was there i better see you night winning i better see you say i was there <laughs> on the next video <laughs> comments <laughs> have a good one everyone stay safe